to my channel welcome back to another month <laughs> hello everyone welcome back to my channel welcome back to another interesting video thank you for clicking on this particular video i really appreciate you good morning good afternoon good evening whenever you are going to watch this video i greet you by your time thank you for clicking thank you for stopping by i really appreciate you so guys today's video we are not going to be eating as you can see or as you can tell by the title today's video we are going to be doing a very quick and easy recipe video okay so this recipe was highly requested by most of my sustainers fried bass okay i did mukbang on my channel almost two light soup recipe okay and most of those videos people have been commenting as you show the recipe of how i make that light soup and i promise i'm going to bring the recipe very soon of which i'm going to be doing today okay i'm going to be doing it today so if you want to know how i make my light soup and you want to see how i prepare my light soup Stay tuned and keep on watching. I know you are going to enjoy the video, okay? If today is the first time I swear coming across my video or seeing this face, hello, this is Lady FK Kitchen. I make videos from Lagos, Nigeria, cooking and monk band video. And I know there is no dull moment here, and you will never regret it if you subscribe to this channel, okay? So please do where to click the red button, subscribe and join the beautiful family. Support your sister by subscribing, turning on the notification post so that whenever I upload a new video, you'll be the first to be notified, okay? So you don't want to miss out on my recipe or my mukbang videos, okay? This channel, we do a lot of demolition. Demolition videos is going on well on this channel. So if you like Africa food, you like Africa delicacy. So please do it to subscribe to support your sister. Okay. So guys, stay tuned and enjoy the video. And please don't forget to share this video. Share, like, leave your comment at the comment section. Okay. So if you want to know how I make my light soup, and you want to see how step-by-step -step process of how I prepare my light soup, stay tuned and keep on watching. And don't forget to like the video, share the video, leave your comments at the comment section. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. So guys, in this bowl here, I have my... I have mackerel fish and turkey in this bowl. You can also use any meat of your choice. You can use ole turkey, you can use ole chicken. So it does not matter the kind of meat you use. Just use any meat of your choice that you feel like eating, okay? And I have my tilapia fish here. I have two tilapia fish here, which I've already washed and cleaned as well. In this bowl here, I have my fresh tomatoes and I have my scotch bonnet pepper and I have my sweet long pepper. I have it like a bat seven long sweet pepper here okay like about seven long sweet pepper and i have my two carrots i have two carrots and i have my two medium size of onions here okay so this is what i have in this book so here i have my ginger and garlic and two onions so these two onions are my ginger and garlic i'm going to be blending it to season my meat and fish all right so here I have my okra and my scott bonnet pepper. I have green scott bonnet pepper here. Okay, I have green scott bonnet pepper and some okra here. Here I have my salt and seasoning cube. And I have my tomato paste here. So I'm going to be pouring my... So I'll pour my tomatoes and my... I'll pour my tomatoes and my carrots. So I'll add my two onions to it, okay? So I added a little bit of water inside, okay? So I'll just cover it and allow it to cook, okay? So it's ready right now. I'll just turn off my cooker. So I'll just turn off my cooker, allow it to cool down and I'll blend. So what I'm going to be doing right now, I'm going to be blending my ginger and garlic and these onions pour it inside my blender and i'll add a little water to it to it so that it will blend faster guys i'm through blending my ginger garlic and my onions so i'll just pour everything inside so i'm going to rest my blender inside my pot
and I'm going to add my tilapia inside my pot as well. So as I said earlier, you can use any fish of your choice. You can as well use only tilapia, you can use turkey, you can use mackerel fish, you can use meat, any meat of your choice, you can use it for your life soon. So it does not matter the type of meat that you use, but I choose to use these three combinations, okay? So I'm going to be adding my seasoning cube. So I'm just trying to break it proper. It's really hard. And I'm going to be adding my salt as well. So after adding my salt, I will cover my pot and allow it to cook on a low heat, not too much high heat, okay? So this has been cooking for like five minutes now, okay? So I'm going to be pouring my tomato. I'm just adding this because I love the color that it gives to my fish, as you can see. So after adding it, uh, pouring it, I will still cover it and allow it to cook. So guys, this is after five minutes, okay? So I allow it to cook on a very low heat. So what I'm going to be doing next, this is my tomatoes that I cooked earlier on that I show you. So I am through blending it. So I'm going to be using my sheave to sheave it inside my soup, okay? So this step is very, very important, okay? So if you pour it inside like that, the soup will be very thick. So this is how I normally do it. So I will just try and make sure that I sheave it inside my soup. So you know it's light soup. So when you do it this way, the tomato that is not blend, all the sharp that is inside, do not enter your soup. Do you see the way I'm doing it? So this is how I'm going to do it until all my tomatoes is out. So it's very so it's very important you do it this way, okay? For you to have a very light, a very light soup, okay? So So I'll just try and risk my blender inside. I can as well use it. Okay, so you we'll see what came out of my tomatoes. Do you see it? So this is what came out of my tomatoes. So I'm not going to be using. We don't need this for our light soup. So it's very important. You shave it so that you have that very light and you know. You see how my pot is now. It's very light and it's okay this way. So. So I just want to show you what I'm trying to say. Okay. So this is the one that I remove now. Okay. You see it? So this is the one that I remove. My last light soup that I did, this is the one that I removed from it, okay? It's still inside my fridge. You see how blocked it is, okay? So you don't need to waste it. So this is the one that I remove now. So I'm just going to keep it inside my fridge. It's not going to waste. Whenever you want to do your tomato sauce, your stew for rice, you can swear use it, okay? You see that? So this is the one that I removed before. So this is one that I did now. <laughs> you don't need to waste food though. It's not good to waste. You see it? So I will just try and stir everything proper. Okay. So 
so guys you don't need to stare i'm just stirring it gently because of my fish i don't want my fish to break okay so i'll just allow it to boil on a medium heat not that not high heat okay allow it to boil on a medium heat so at this stage just test for your salt for your seasoning if there's anything that you can add to it okay mine is perfectly okay so i don't need to add anything to it what i need right now i'm just going to cover it i'll cover it and allow it to cook on a medium heat for at least 20 to 25 minutes so guys let's check up our soup wow i don't want to I don't want to stir it because of my fish i don't want it to break so you can see our soup is doing so well our soup is doing so well <laughs> So I'll still allow the soup to cook for at least 10 minutes, okay? At this stage, I'm going to be adding my okra to it. I'll add my okra to it and I'm going to be adding my green scott bonnet pepper that I showed you earlier on, okay? So I'll just add it to it and I'll allow it to simmer for another 10 minutes. all right guys our soup is ready okay our soup is ready so guys i hope you enjoyed the video all right our soup is ready so at this stage by now your swallow is ready that you use and enjoy this soup okay by now your swallow is ready okay so i hope you enjoy the video you like the way i show you how to make light soup okay this is ghana style before i forgot <laughs> so this is ghana light soup, soup okay so thank you all so much for watching thank you i hope you enjoyed the video all right so thank you all so much for watching i will see you all in my next video